Hey y'all, I'm about to show you how to use the Wi-Fi hotspot. Wi-Fi tethering router, excuse me. Basically you hit and actively turn that on. And I'm gonna show you the settings I use and everything. But while it's doing that, you have, your phone has to be rooted. There's no way around it. Um, and you gotta set up like a, I forgot, I think it's APN, I don't know what that means, but access point, yeah. So, as you can see, my, my, um, my name is YouTube for the Wi-Fi network, and the password is YouTube123. So, we're gonna look for that. As you can see, we see it right there. YouTube. So you click on that, hit connect, put the password, YouTube123. Hit next. Well, no, I don't want to grab it. And now that it's connected, remember, I'm on 4G right now. I'm not on, I'm not on light because where I'm at in my house, it's no light. I'll have to put my phone kind of positioned by the window and stuff. But as you can see, I'm going to start this and then we're going to come back here to see the green and the yellow go up. As you can see, this is starting. Give it a sec. Okay. Now look at this. The green and the yellow. The numbers is going up. As you can see. So it actually works. That's what I want to show y'all. Now to really show y'all, um, we're going to do a test with the Wi-Fi with my PS4. So, give me one sec while I'm punching this stuff in here. As you can see, it's the YouTube one, same one. Now we're gonna test out the um, internet on here. Or maybe it don't work here. I've never tried it on here. This is my first time, so I like it's taking a little longer than this. Okay, it worked. Let's touch the internet now. I might actually do some gameplay if y'all request it. Just hit the like button and put in a comment you want to see gameplay with it. And of course, I won't use gameplay using 4G. I'll have to get the Wi-Fi running, so uh, I could do that, so don't worry about that, I just have to hook it up in my room, but just let me know if you want to see that, uh, it's taking a while, see what, like, the cable speed, it'll show this automatically real quick, but, as you can see, that is still, it's going, it's moving, well, it stopped. Oh, there we go. It's, as you can see right there, that's no good. That's on 4G. Of course, I wouldn't play no games or recommend nobody to play no games on 4G speed. That you, will, you won't be able to. Okay, now 
go back to the phone. I'm going to show you how I set this up. So as I show y'all, basically you go to more networks and settings, then you go to mobile networks, then you go to access point names. Then you make your own name. I'm not going to make my name. I already did it. But you can put this as any name you want. But it got the APN. Got to be exactly as that. So I'm going to zoom in on that for you. So you can see. Basically got to say fast dot T mobile dash. Well, excuse me. Fast dot T dash mobile dot com. And you got to set this to IP4. Remember, APN protocol IP4. And then I set it this to make my messages work so I don't got to switch between these, two, between these two. So, I'm going to show you the last thing to this. I'm going to disable it to show you my settings. Give it a sec while it disables. Remember, please, if you like this video, if it worked for you, please hit like. Subscribe if it didn't work, having problems. Hit me with a message, I may be able to help you. Okay. And my interface, you don't got to worry about none of this. Matter of fact, this is matter of fact, let's go step into this real quick. You could change your um your network name, of course, your network password. Wi-Fi channel is supposed to be on number one. As you can see. The interface. Remember. On the top one, W L A N zero method, as you can see, host APD. Mm. Prevent standby if you don't want it to stay on the screen. But this is where the tricky part comes in. Make sure you have this off. Make sure. I mean, make sure you have this check. Excuse me. Make sure you have this check. Oh, no. Oh. Make sure you have this check. And then no Wi-Fi. No disabled Wi-Fi. Excuse me. Make sure you got that check. These two things is important to be checked. And that's basically it. Oh, but one more thing. Then on your Wi-Fi settings, go to advanced and Make sure allow always allow scanning. It's not checked. That will give you problems. I found it working sometimes with it checked, so maybe you can play with it and see if it works for you. But if make sure you when you first try it, make sure that's not checked. Okay. Um that's basically it. Hit like or subscribe on my channel. If you like the video, any send any comments about the video pertaining to the app. This is the app you'll get. Wi-Fi Teva router. Thank you.